we'll see how busy we are today. I'm thinking it's not gonna be super busy, but we'll get some traffic from the people leaving Sonoma to go to, to Napa. And I'm full staffed, all hands on deck today. So in the event that it does get busy, we should be covered. My eyes are bugging the sh out of me today. We got a new train today for work. Well, it's Sunday, so it's gonna be a long day for me. Time-wise, I'm here all day. Did not sleep well last night. I went to bed at a reasonable hour. I woke up at like four, and then I woke up again at six. Not happy. I'm in our office during, let me back up. Three day weekends in the restaurant industry is very crazy and hectic. And then all of a sudden there's like, like the day after any three day weekend, it's like half the people that you would normally had come in just disappear. So in this case, Tuesday is going to be like a ghost town here, unless something crazy is going on in town. Um, so basically what, um, what I'm trying to get at is about this hour, 530, I like to take a good 45 minutes at least where I just disconnect from the restaurant and I go and take, you know, some fresh air, a little walk. But today, because it's Memorial Day weekend, I can feel the tension of all the people that want to just come in and I like I feel like I can't leave like I feel like at any given time my workers are gonna call me and there's gonna be something that needs to be addressed here so I'm in our office I'm gonna answer some emails watch some YouTube just kind of try to disconnect from the loud bustle from the restaurant and and take a little bit of time for myself let out a couple good farts, a couple good like belches. I shouldn't say that. Um, so that's where I'm at. So here we are on our way home. Dinner was busy. Good busy day. Basically Memorial Day weekend lived up to its expectations of being busy. I'm glad I didn't leave the restaurant. I just kind of stayed around to make sure that in case they needed me I would be around. We usually leave about 9.45 and it is now about 11.30 I'm getting home. So good busy day. Picked up some bread before I left the restaurant at the Basque. What's up, chicken? How are you? Oh my god, Zeke. Have you been out all night? Buddy. Oh, food processor's out. Wonder, wonder what she cooked. What do you want, food? Hello. 
Where are you? Oh, ready? Why? Hello? You wanna watch The Cell? Oh my god. Kinda, right? I've never seen it. Do you wanna watch it? Isn't it scary? No. It's like a thriller. You know what the best part is? I wasn't even recording when I when we talked about that. The whole time I was telling you what was in it? Yeah, I need a new phone case, I think. Mm -hmm. This one's really messing up. Okay, cilantro, spinach, almonds, serrano. Green onions. Green onions. Garlic. Vinegar. vinegar. And olive oil. And olive oil. And avocado. Delicious. No. Come on, fat dude. Come on. See, he quietly wants us to come up to bed, and then he, when we're up here, he just like pretends to be shy. Come on, we're gonna watch Jennifer Lopez movie. I think when I saw this movie, I was like, I was like 11, 12. I remember it was just like a creepy movie. Okay, yeah, it's like a thriller. It's like Silence of the Lambs. Hmm. Didn't she like go to hell or something? No, she's she's like a psychiatrist and she goes into like a serial killer's brain. Oh, I'm way off. It's fucking weird. You gotta suspend a lot of belief. 